Greetings. I was thinking about that song, uh, me and Bobby McGee, Freedom is Just Another Word for Nothing Left to Lose. And I was thinking of replacing it with the idea of forgiveness uh, is just another word for nothing left to lose. The idea being that uh, most people wait until, you know, they trash their lives. They hit a bottom before they decide to, you know, change dramatically, to, to uh, let go, to let God, to, to open up their spiritual center. Uh, it, it's like forgiveness and spirituality is on the bottom of the, of the food chain. You know, uh, like do everything else before you decide to get loving and compassionate and forgiving. This is like the, the last resort. And uh, this thinking is all upside down. It's got to be the other way around. And when people start to learn that, that uh, y your first prime directive, your first goal, you know, at the top of the, of the hierarchy list should be your attempt to be a loving, giving, compassionate, accepting, and forgiving person. That's the way it should be, uh, uh, you know, and, and the irony is, the irony is that in the long run, whether in this, this life or the next, but uh, in the long run, uh, when you uh, focus first on forgiveness, on assumable acts of kindness to others, you, you know, this is where you have everything to gain. This is where you will be at the top of the chain sooner or later. Uh, the meek shall inherit the earth does not mean the weak. It does not mean the feeble. It means those who are gen generous, those who are compassionate, those who are charitable, those who are gracious and grateful, those who are accepting, those who are forgiving. The whole idea of survival of, of the fittest is like so upside down. Yeah, survival of the fittest. Yes, true. But people think that means fittest is strongest. Fittest means like the mightiest, uh, physically strongest, the physically mightiest. Those who can beat down somebody else, you know, that's the fittest. No, no, no. Survival of the fittest uh, sooner or later is going to come down to uh, those who are emotionally fit, those who are spiritually the fittest, okay? So try to hold that thought that, uh, that forgiveness is not about, you know, oh, I got nothing left to lose, so I might as well try being forgiving now. I've tried everything else. Now I'll try this, you know, save yourself a lot of time and trouble. Spare yourself, you know, trashing your life, your friends, your loved ones, your job, your career, your money. You know, just right now, start the process of forgiving others. Right now, start the process of letting go of judgments, jealousies, resentments, and attack thoughts. Start now the process of, uh, of getting out of yourself. Uh, what can I do for others rather than what's in it for me? All right, take care. Peace be with you.